Now, a primary school in Butere in the county of Kakamega is facing imminent closure due to lack of peat latrines. Now, the county's public health department now wants the management of Etarira Primary School to construct toilets or have the school shut down. Our Shadrach Miti tells us more. A Tatira Primary School in Butere constituency, Kakamega County, is estimated to have a population of close to 400 pupils. <laughs> but even as these young girls and boys put on smiling faces, there is a problem. The school doesn't have adequate toilets to cater for the huge population, a condition that forced public health officers to intervene by issuing a notice of closure of the school. The total number of children in the school is around 383 and we have only four toilets for girls while the other uh, eight are for the boys so they're not enough for the to serve the, the 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 population now for every 30 boys we require to have one pit latrine and plus a urino and for every 25 girls we require one pit latrine that letter from the Department of Public Health was written and dispatched to the school management on the 22nd day of July 2019. The notice was to last for 21 days, and already the ultimatum has elapsed, making the situation even more risky for the entire Etatira Primary School fraternity. Already public health officers have written a reminder and final warning letter, which means the school may be closing any time from now. Kwa hivyo shule ikifungwa sijui tutaenda wapi. Na hao wanafunzi wanatakiwa waendelee wale wafanye mtihani. The head teacher Belinda Murunga feels the school has been neglected by leaders and everything here appears to be on a downward spiral. If it's not lack of toilets, the classrooms are being condemned. We are to the extreme end of Kakamega County, we are neighboring Siaya. The last school, so ni kama tuko na shida, shule imesaulika. Madarasa, tuna lila mbalo liko three, four classrooms have been condemned. Upande moja imeanguka. We do not have a kitchen. Ni mambo mabaya. We have given them a reminder notice and we are going to follow it up to the latter. And once they don't meet the requirements, we may close the school. Although the explanation that the challenge could be due to the school being on the border between two counties, the entire situation at the school raises a lot of questions. Unajua, you are a teacher, you are coming in school. There's nowhere where you can go mm, to release yourself. So we are just urging that well, let, let the, the, the those ones concerned. What side here? Uh, this school is really hit. R right from time immemorial, we have not had very good uh, assistance from the, the local uh, area leaders and even the, the nation at large. I want to believe that now that uh, maybe it will be publicized through the media, we are going to have some uh, help, some change actually in the school. That term is very short. No school would want to waste any time on non-academic issues. A situation that explains why it is imperative for a quick solution to be found immediately.